will be in the Kia Fit. And this is a very easy tutorial. I encourage you um, to take your time, go through it, learn it. Um, if you don't have your notes memorized yet, check the link um, for Amazon. There are stickers that you can buy to put on your keyboard that will show you where the notes are. You can get that from Amazon. Uh, very inexpensive, okay? And this is a very easy, basic way to play The Blessing. I'm going to play it once through, and then we'll go through the breakdown of the chords and the notes that I'm using. Okay? Here we go. Maybe the chorus, ah, man, so, you know. But basically, those are all the chords. Very simple. The song is actually very repetitive as far as the chords. And I think you'll have a really easy time learning it. Um, so the first set of chords on your right hand. Okay. So on your right hand, we have E flat, G flat, B. On your left hand which is your bass, you'll have B. And then on your right hand, you're gonna bounce it four times. But your bass, you'll keep that still. So one, two, three, four. Then the next one, two, three, four. So the second chord is E, A flat, B. And you have E on the bass. So hold that E and do your chords four times. is E flat G flat B with a E flat bass so once again four times on the right hand and you want to hold that bass steady on E flat okay next chord is E flat G flat B flat with a G flat bass and once again four times Have a little passing notes to get you to the next part so it's so it's a flat b flat so so it's from the last chord you have so so that is going to be e flat a flat b with an a flat bass and once again four times on the right hand here is E, A flat, B with the E bass and once again four times on the right hand. Okay, you have E flat, G flat, B with an E flat bass. Now this you don't bounce. Okay, you have D flat, G flat, B flat with a G flat B bass. Last 
um, chord is basically the first chord. <laughs> so uh, you go um, E flat, G flat, B, B bass. Okay. So from there, usually they do the verse like twice. So to get you back into um, the verse again, there's a little passing chord you could do. So after you hit the last, so, uh, uh, so, so, and keep you, then you could do that as a passing to either go to the chorus or back to the beginning verse. So, so only thing we did for that passing chord, we moved that E flat up to an E. So it's E, G flat, B, okay? You're still on your B bass, so. Oh, bless you. So we're going to go right into the ah uh, man chorus. So, okay, you got these passing notes uh, again, which is A flat, B flat. So, and keep, so, so go. So that part, you have D, I mean, sorry, E flat, A flat, B, with A flat bass. Once again, four times. One, two, uh, uh, man, two, three, four. So man is E, A flat, B, with a E bass. This right here is D flat, G flat, B flat, with a G flat bass four times again. Then those passing notes again. So those passing notes again are A flat, B flat. So, so you got to repeat that chorus again. Ah, uh, man. special of may his favor be upon you to a thousand generations so you can do those passing notes again may his favor be upon you okay so we have e flat a flat b the a flat bass so one two three may his favor be upon you and a thousand two three four okay and you'll notice a lot of these chords are the same. It's very repetitive, like I said. Um, so this one is E, A flat, B, with an E bass. And your family and your children. Okay? Family and your children. So you have E flat, G flat, B, with a B bass. Children and your children. This one right here is D flat, G flat, B flat with a B flat bass. And then you can just repeat it. Man, uh, 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 As they need to do it <laughs> and then usually you go back to the chorus from there so
basically that's the song guys like i said it's very simple if you have any questions feel free to reach out and uh i hope you enjoyed the tutorial thank you for watching